Mm -hmm. Oreo cookies are a typical snack for the Bouchard family in their Polk City home. <laughs> but anything with dairy or nuts is off limits. They could go into anaphylactic reactions. All four of the Bouchard children have food allergies and need an EpiPen nearby at all times. The device saved their son's life years ago. He grabbed his throat, couldn't breathe. He was grasping for air within. I'd say within a minute. One EpiPen used to cost around $100, but when Amy recently went to pick up four from the pharmacist, she was shocked. They said that it would be um, over $500 per kid. So we have four children that each require an EpiPen, and so that'll be $2,000. The company Mylint that makes EpiPens recently hiked up prices after the only other company making the product went under. Epinephrine is not that expensive of a drug. So to increase this for families, I think, is shameful. Monday, Senator Grassley wrote a letter to the executive director of Milan demanding answers to questions about pricing and patient assistant programs. Senator Ernst says she's willing to team up with Senator Grassley. I do think it is important that we figure out why is this happening? Because if it's with the EpiPens, it very well could be with other types of medications that are necessary for families. The Bouchards say they will make sacrifices to make it work, but they know other families who just can't afford to pay $500 for one EpiPen. I just would hate for families to have to go through that.